The Kerala High Court has refused to dismiss legal proceedings against a man accused of making defamatory comments about a Muslim woman under Section 153 of the IPC that is provoking with intent to cause a riot and Section 119 of the Kerala Police Act, which is atrocities against women. The man had alleged that the woman committed adultery and violated Sharia law by shaking hands with the former Finance Minister of Kerala, Dr. Thomas Isaac, during a college event. Justice P.V. Kunhi Krishnan emphasized that religious beliefs are personal and the constitution guarantees every individual the right to practice their religion in their own way. The court noted that while some Muslim traditions view physical contact between unrelated men and women as forbidden, there is no compulsion in religion, as even the Quran highlights personal choice. The woman, a law graduate, had participated in an event where she shook hands with the minister after receiving a gift. The man's social media post and circulated videos accused her of violating religious laws which brought shame to her family. The court firmly stated that the constitution is supreme and no one can impose their religious beliefs on others. The court dismissed the man's plea to quash the case, stating that whether he committed the alleged offences would be decided in the trial court. If proven innocent, he could be acquitted, but the case would proceed for now. The court stressed that no religious belief is above the constitution and the woman's personal freedom must be protected. If you wish to read this news in detail, click on the link in the description. And for more such legal updates, please follow Life Law.